All right, so we've got Fire Prevention Week uh, starting. Um, and boy, this year it just happens to coincide with everybody's furnace, I think. Uh, starting, ah. to, <laughs> starting to click on. Uh, there's some things people should keep in mind this time of year is there. Uh, you know, you're trying to, you're trying to avoid fire. Yeah, and absolutely. A couple of things. First and foremost, just take time to get around the house, check your smoke detectors, and check your carbon monoxide detectors. Those are the things that are going to give you that early warning um, in case something is going bad. Uh, and then obviously, you know, if your furnace hasn't been checked for a while, I mean, we always recommend that people get in an authorized service center to give the furnace a once over to make sure there's no problems, check the chimney, that kind of stuff. And the particular problems too this time of year, just when it starts getting cold at night and with wood burners and things like that? Yeah, I mean, most people that have wood burning stoves are very, very um, attuned to the precautions that you have to take. Um, and obviously one of the most important ones is, is never overstock a wood burning stove so that it actually gets hotter than what it's rated for and things like that. Well, great. And uh, anything else people should keep in mind as, uh, as this week is underway? Well, I mean, a lot of the schools around the county and a lot of the fire departments around the county are doing open houses and educational events. And really the important thing is for the parents to take a few minutes, talk with their kids about the lessons, help reinforce the lessons that they're learning either at the open houses or in their school this week.